Well, hey guys, welcome back once again to Jack's Tech Corner and another exciting unboxing video. You know, it's been quite a while since Amazon's been putting this software in a box. Now they send it in a package. But, so what is today's unboxing video? The title always gives it away. It's Photoshop Elements 2022, and I always buy it in a packaged format. I don't like the digital downloads. It just seems like you're not really getting anything for your money. I like to buy it in a package. So they have to ship it to me and it's the same price. So why not have the, the, uh, the media, right? The install media. Let's go ahead and take a look what's in the package here. Just rip this open. Been kind of excited to see this because I've had it for a few days and I had to wait to do this video. So there it is, folks. Photoshop Elements 20. 22, the latest edition from Adobe for all of us Photoshop Elements lovers out there. So what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to move the cameras around a little bit so we can uh, maybe put the camera over the desk here. And uh, I'll open the box there and show you what's inside, what you get for your, you know. Uh, I just got this on special this year for like $60. Uh, I do buy this. They don't give it to me just because I do videos. Uh, I buy it every year so I can teach you folks out there more about Photoshop Elements. So, uh, the normal price, I believe, is $99, but the upgrade is worth the price. And I know a lot of you out there running pretty old versions. So, definitely, you want to uh, get the newest version and get this on your computer. So, let's go ahead, without further ado, and unbox this thing and see what's in this package. Let me get the camera moved around and we'll get started. Okay, folks, now that I got the cameras re-situated here, you can see it's Photoshop Elements 2022, the latest edition from Adobe. Adobe, Adobe. <laughs> there you go. Anyway, that's my little sound effects, huh? Go ahead, I'm gonna use this pen, I think, to try to get the plastic off of this thing. Um, yeah, it might not be the best idea. I've ever had. I do have a pair of scissors. Let me grab the scissors here and uh, we'll be able to at least open up the top of this thing. So I've been kind of excited to have this thing. On the back here, they always show you the newest features, um, which uh, you can edit, create, share, we organize. We know we can do all that, right? And if you don't, make sure you watch my videos, right? at uh, 42 Techno Man or search for Jack's Tech Corner. The official unboxing of the software. Okay, I gotta make sure, I gotta see where the keys are. Keys are in the back. Okay, I can't, can't get my keys away here. Um, so when you buy the CD, the reason I like buying the CD kits, I'm gonna try to spin this one over for you here so you can see it's a little better is if you look at this one, let me see if I get this in focus here. Um, you see where it says Windows right there? Maybe, right there, Windows. So you get the Windows Edition, as well as uh, the Mac OS Edition. You see where it says Mac OS right there? Uh, there you go, Mac OS, Photoshop Elements 2022. So you get both of the media editions in there. When you buy the download version, you're gonna download either the Windows or the Mac version, okay? So depending on what you have. What else is in the box? You know what else is in the box? Look. Yeah, you can't see anything because you know what's in the box? Nothing! Air! Air. But you do get this pretty case. Look at this pretty box here, so. New uh, new features in it. We went over these on my uh, channel on uh, 42 Techno Man or Jack's Tech Corner. New instantly turn photos into art. So you have artwork. New wrap photos to fit any style. You can wrap these to go around a coffee mug and such. Select your subject with a click. I've seen though no, that kind of works a little bit depending on what your background is. Erase the distractions like magic. So there's another new. Um, Animated overlays, which you can't print an animated overlay, so that's kind of a, a bogus thing. I guess you can email to somebody. Uh, turn still photos into MP4s. All that, folks, means is you can create a slideshow. 
we've been creating slideshows with years, four years. On the back here you see, extend background to create a landscape or reframe your subjects. You say you got this and now you can make a nice landscape. And these do look really, really nice on your walls, especially the living room. Uh, down here we have new, create perfect pet pics. Uh, they're like take the collar and stuff off your pet, you know, uh, bogus stuff. But we can do that before with a couple of tools that we have, all right? Um, swap backgrounds in seconds. So now you can swap background. And that's a really nice feature. People love to swap backgrounds. Down here, explore new slideshow styles. If you can see that, slideshow styles, new. Uh, so you can do that. Uh, make a statement with, quote, graphics. Hey, folks, you can put words on your graphics. Really? Really, Adobe? Like, that's really anything? Come on. That's really nothing at all. <laughs> 60 new guided edits. Uh, I think it's 60 in total. It's not 60 new. Trust me, it's not 60 new. Um, but as I said earlier in the video, and uh, I think I'll move the camera back around here one more time to close this video out, and I'll give you my final thoughts. But if you're going to spend the money, go to Amazon. Um, you know what, I'll have a link in the description below. Click on my link and purchase it there. Um, a couple dollars comes back to the show, so it's always good for the, uh, for the YouTube videos to help out, right, when you can. If you're going to buy it anyway, but buy the box set. Don't buy the download set, buy the box. Just so you have something in your hand for your money, right? I, I just, that's what it is. I know you're paying for the software. I understand that, but it's nice to have a box, so. All right, let me turn the video around here and uh, fix this camera up and we'll uh, say our goodbyes. All right, folks, I'm going to finish up by just saying that, you know, if you have any version older than 2020 or 2020, yeah, version 2020, upgrade to 2022. Come on. I mean, it's great software. You're going to get a lot of features that you don't have. I know somebody emailed me the other day and said, hey, Jack, I got a, I have a package uh, that I've been using from 2016 or something or version 9 or 10 upgrade to 2022. I can't tell you what the new Mac operating system, people have been having trouble with this. I've been seeing that in the forums. I also been seeing that on Facebook that people have been having issues with the new software. So um, with my Mac, I don't really upgrade to the new operating system as soon as it comes out because it's going to be buggy and you're going to find software that's not quite ready. And the people are yelling at Adobe like, you should have had it ready. It's like, maybe, maybe, maybe they didn't get a pre-release copy of the new uh, OS or the... Uh, Microsoft's, op or not, I'm sorry, the Mac operating system. Maybe they didn't get a new version. Who knows? I don't know how it runs on um, oh, um, Windows 11. I haven't tried that yet. So I'll test that out and see how it loads up and how it runs. Um, I did have the demo version on it. It seemed to be pretty good. So we'll, we'll talk about that when I get there. But, but thank you so much for watching the official unboxing of Photoshop Elements 2022. I hope you come back and watch more of my videos. If you're not subscribed, please click that subscribe button. Hit that little like button. Hit that bell. Ding, ding, ding. You know, to be notified when I post new videos. And, uh, and I also have a couple other series that you may or may not like. Uh, so if you're here just for Photoshop, remember that I do playlists. So everything's focused towards you, the viewer. So thanks so much for watching. It's because you... Watch the videos is the reason that we produce this stuff. So thanks, and I will talk to you next time right here on Jack's Tech Corner in the beautiful Jack's Tech Corner studio here in southwestern Pennsylvania. Remember, keep those shutters clicking, keep those editors editing, and I'll see you back here next time on Jack's Tech Corner. Bye for now.